So right now we are told that a manhunt is underway for the man that lived inside of this home right behind me. As you mentioned, Chris, he is armed and dangerous, according to law enforcement. And we just got word that he might have ditched his original vehicle. Law enforcement officers in Liberty County and across Texas are looking for this man, 59-year-old Jose Soriano. Liberty County deputies say he could be heading to Houston, traveling in a silver or gray pickup truck. Deputies returned to the wooded area where one of the two women they say Soriano held captive inside of his Plum Grove home was found dead Saturday night. Soriano is now wanted in connection with her murder. Investigators say Soriano lured the two women to his home, threatening them with personal photos he had of the women. The women cleaned for Soriano, according to deputies. Investigators say Soriano pulled a gun on the women, tying one up, beating, then assaulting her. The second woman was able to escape and back out of the driveway, but crashed into the woods across from the home. She was found with a gunshot wound inside of the burned car. Neighbors told deputies they heard several gunshots. Soriano has not been seen since. He left his cell phone inside of the home, which the surviving victim was able to use to call for help. Deputies just informed us that they now have Soriano's pickup truck in custody. They believe he swapped out vehicles and is now driving a relative's 2009 black Honda Accord. That license plate on your screen right now, that number, it's NDD7500. If you see him, deputies here in Liberty County asking that you not approach instead to call them. Their number, 936 336 4500. Reporting live in Liberty County in the Plum Grove area, Taisha Walker, KPRC, Channel 2 News.